Hey guys, it's Nerd Nick, and this is the Raiden. Now this plane was designed by Kevin Matusik. He actually sent me this kit and asked me to review it. Um, he's a community member just like you guys, and he has developed this and, and been testing it. He said, hey Nick, I want you to give it a shot. Can you do that? So I said, sure. Um, so if you guys have a plane that you've designed or you've seen one that you'd like to see me review, let me know. Uh, post a comment and I'll check it out. Now this plane is uh, its a pusher prop, and I'm going to go ahead and wing launch it just so I don't have any problems here. All right, here we go. Now it's very windy, but it's actually flying really well considering how strong the wind is blowing right now. This is the canard type plane. It's very interesting. The CG actually isn't even over the wing, it's over the fuselage. <laughs> Which is a little different. Um, it seems to handle pretty nice. It's got a nice quick roll. I don't have very much throw on it. Uh, the roll is, is real stable. Uh, elevator is very solid. It doesn't, it's not very pitchy feeling at all. Uh, it feels very smooth. And considering how windy it is, I'm actually surprised at how well it's handling. This thing's got a pretty big wingspan. Uh, I think it's over 40 inches. So it's got a lot of surface, a lot of lift. Um, Kevin's designed an FPV version of this plane as well. Uh, you should definitely check that out if you're into FPV. This thing's handling really nice though. I'm running the Power Pack C from Flight Test on this with the 8.6 prop. Pretty quick too. We're gonna do a stall test here. We're gonna pull a little higher. So there's no throttle. Not tipping over at all. Totally flat. Very nice. Did not lose control of the plane at any point during that. Yeah, it's a fun little plane. I'll go ahead and bring it in. Let's see how it lands. Very nice. Very nice. Guys, thanks for checking out the Raiden. Again, this was designed by Kevin Matusik. He's got free plans available, and I think he's actually going to be selling kits if you'd like to buy one of these. Um, he has those available. I'll, I'll put a link in the description for the build article, the plans, his review, and everything, so you can check that out. Um, I thought the build itself went together really easy. Uh, it was, it's an intermediate. If you can build a flight test plane, you can build one of these, no problem. Um, durability is pretty good. I haven't had any problems yet. I did see some people had some uh, issue with the fuselage uh, being damaged on crashes, but I think Kevin's addressed that by adding some more support um, to, to, the, to the fuselage. In terms of the visuals, I think it looks great. It's a great looking plane. Canards are definitely not a very common type plane, so it's, it's, it's kind of unique. And people around here you know, have already commented on how nice it looks and how cool it looks. So um, you, you'll definitely be the talk of the field if you have one of these. Uh, in terms of flight characteristics, uh, you guys saw it, the slow flight performance was amazing. It didn't have any stall, uh, bad stall tendencies. It just kind of sank when I when I dropped the throttle. Uh, I still had control, a very, very nice um, uh, floaty kind of experience. 
Uh, slow speed in general was good. It had it had good control while while flying slow. Uh, as fast was was pretty good as well. This is um, the Power Pack C from Flight Test, running with an 8.6 prop. I felt like I had some pretty good performance, but you could probably put a bigger motor or a higher KV motor on here to get some more speed. Um, in terms of the rolls and loops, it, 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 it was a little slower than I would have, have loved. Uh, I don't have the rates super high, but it, it definitely, you feel the plane um, uh, lightness. It, it does not feel very heavy, it does not feel very solid. It, it, it's a very soft feeling plane, which makes it easy to fly, but it's not super crisp. So if you're looking for something that's really snappy, uh, you might want to dial the rates up on this one or maybe get a little heavier, might, might perform a little better there. But overall, I thought it flew really good. Um, I'll definitely be keeping this plane around for a while. So guys, thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.